The sanctuary's bat cave is massive. Stretching over the walkway, going between the two parts of the enclosure, there is a thin mesh covering, allowing the cave's habitants freedom to soar. Doran approaches the surface ladder and unlocks it. Once he is through, he closes it and locks it again so that none of the flying rodents can escape. One of the bats screeches at him and flutters its wings in his general direction. Hush now, Doran tells it. With the black light projecting out from the wall, he can see a cluster of 30 of the small flyers dangling upside down. They are staring at him, as they normally do when one comes into their enclosure. Doran slips the remains of his lunch out of his school bag. An orange. When he has peeled it, he splits it up and spreads the fruit around on the walkway. The bats are not shy to come down and devour the fruit. Doran watches them and smells them in. He reaches out with every fiber of his being to see what makes them then. The world becomes a bustling explosion of sound and warped sensation. And with that, he knows he has become a bat. Hello, I'm Rob Queen. You might know me from my first fantasy novel, The Twelve Cataclysms, or maybe from my eight-page story, Higher Expectations, A Tale of Fish, in the comic book anthology, Subcultures. Maybe you know me from the DC fan fiction starring the Vixen, which is currently being posted on Wattpad. Or maybe you know me from my page on Facebook, The Twelve Cataclysms, hyphen, Rob Queen. As for who I am, well, I'm a 16-year-old suffering a horrible case of premature aging. Gray hair, the beard, wrinkles, eh. And if you believe that, then you'll believe that my name is really Troy McClure. Bad Simpsons jokes aside, it is the teenage years that I'm here to talk about with you today. Over the past 20 months, I have been in the process of putting together two different novels. The first of them is actually the aforementioned Vixen story currently being serialized on Wattpad. Actually, go check it out. You should check it out right now, and I'll wait. Welcome back. I hope that was a fun read. It was certainly a whole lot of fun to write, and best of all is that it gets updated with new chapters every single week. And every once in a while, I sprinkle in an extra chapter, just because. It's all finished. All it needs is uploading, so keep coming back every week for more chapters. The other novel that I wrote is getting ready for publication via Amazon.com's CreateSpace. It is a 130,000 word novel starring a young man named Doran Titus. His parents' animal sanctuary, which is essentially a zoo, has given Doran a vast experience of animals and a really important sense of responsibility. So he must juggle all of these responsibilities with his high school career. And in the process of this, he gets derailed by a situation that he wasn't expecting. Namely, he learns that he can take the shape of different animals. In Escape from the Spotlight, Doran finds a grand adventure that pushes his imagination, one that's filled with excitement, romance, heartbreak, betrayal, popularity, and a whole subversion of everything that he thought he knew. I'm publishing this book outright because I feel that that would be a better way to get it out to you all. Publication, however, takes a number of resources, and that's what I'm asking for today. Your contribution could help to make this happen. And in return, there are a number of perks for you as my way of saying thank you. With your aid, I hope to get this out and to the general populace in December. The campaign will finish in October. That means that your copies would be exclusives for a whole month before they go mainstream. Any help you can provide would be most appreciated, not only financially, but through word of mouth. So let people know about this. Go to your local library, tell people online, go to your local school, high school, middle school, comic book store, and let them know about this campaign that I'm running here.
We've only got 30 days to raise the funds, and I cannot do it alone. Doran needs your help. He needs all the help that he can get. And anything that you can do will take us one step closer towards our goal. I'm Rob Queen, and on behalf of Doran Titan and everyone else in Escape from the Spotlight, many, many thanks.